Saquon Barkley. So <laughs> it was a wild play, and it was funny. So last night, went out to, to with some guys from from church, watched Monday Night Football, and on my way there, I, I love this podcast, Kyle Brandt. He does 10 takes 10, 10 in 10 minutes. So it's a nice little 10-minute drive, 10-minute podcast. So shout out to Kyle Brandt. Uh, he's from Good Morning Football on NFL Network. But he was talking about the Saquon Barkley uh, reverse hurdle. And he was just beside himself. He's like, it's unbelievable. And it is. It's, it's a remarkable pre- play. We have never really seen anything like it. Well, then one of my buddies last night, he goes, well, yeah, it was cool. But what did it do? It didn't really benefit anything, which is kind of true. Like, he didn't really go anywhere. So I'm probably in the middle there where it's a, it's a memorable play. I already saw a Nike advertisement where they reversed the, the Nike swoosh and, and, you know, we're all witnesses or whatever their slogan is. Uh, so that's clever. That's good marketing. So good, good shout out for, for Nike on that one. But the Eagles, they seem to have turned the corner. However, Nick Sirianni continues to be this question mark for them. It's just so interesting where the, the Eagles still aren't fully behind them. At least fans aren't. Wait, there's still some questionable plays throughout the game. They let Jacksonville back in that one. I mean, Jacksonville. Oh, Jacksonville. There's a moment of silence for Jacksonville. Them and the Raiders, their season's absolutely over. And, and it's just so disappointing, especially for Jacksonville, because they, they want to be in the mix. They want to be in the playoffs. They, they're, they're at that level. They, they should not be rebuilding. That's not, that's not where they're at in the, in the process. I mean, the Raiders, I guess, are, are definitely in that mode. But, uh, but anyway, the, the Eagles... They're one of the better teams in the NFC, but they still have to get rid of some of the goofiness that they're doing. And and again, allowing the Jags back in that game was not great. 